Hello and welcome to this program from Libre, uh, this part of video from libreprogramming.org. In this part, we will learn about swapping even and odd position bits of an integer. So, this video will be on YouTube as well as on Kunjika. It will contain uh, an embedding of YouTube video, so you can watch at Kunjika and you can ask your questions here. The source code will be provided uh, in Kunjika under the question title bit swapping C implementation. So what do I mean by bit swapping is suppose input is 1 then output should be 2 that is bit at position 0 that is 1 goes to position 1. So this is position 0 it goes left. Now if input is 2 output should be 1 others were 0 so changing them will not make any impact. Now in this case the only bit which is 1 is this one so it will go to its right that is odd position and even position so they are exchanged say for example in case of uh, 3 so it remains unchanged input 3 will be output 3 because 1 and 1 will change position so the number will not change but suppose it, if it is 100 that is input is 4 then output would be 8 why because this one which is at position 3 will go at position 4 here so it will become 1000 because when these two zeros will change position nothing will change for 5 it would be 10 because this one will go here 0 will come here and this one will change position with a 0 which is here for let's say for the sake of it and if input is 6 then output would be 9 and for 7 we will get 11 and for 8 we will get 4 so how do we make this? So we scan number. Then we have two integers. One consists entirely of odd bits. Another consists entirely of even bits. So we iterate from 0 to 31. And what we do is we create a bit mask. Now in this even bits, only bits at position even, at even position, the bit will be 1. Otherwise, the bit will remain 0. This is done through this if code. So if the remainder of i is 0, even bit will be made 1. Otherwise, odd bit will be made 2. This is left shift. So in the beginning, i would be 0. So it even bit will become 1. And then even bits will become 1. And when i becomes 2, this one left shift two positions so from 0th position it will uh, go to the third position because it is zero based index so i is equal to zero essentially means first position while i is equal to two means third position so and for odd bits uh, all the bits at odd positions would be one and then we filter out and uh, get the odd bits and even bits in the number through AND gate. So that is that's why we have created the bit mask. Using the AND gates we separate out odd bits and even bits and then what we do is we shift odd bits to right. So whatever is at position uh, say uh, if we take for example 0 based index whatever is at position 1, 3, 5, 7 will shift to right. And whatever is at position 0, 2, 4, 6, 8 will shift to left and then we OR them to get the final number. And then we just print it. So let's see this uh, in running. My equal to bits. So for example, we say 1. So 1 becomes 2. 2 becomes 1. 3 becomes 3. That is 3 will not change. 4 becomes 8. 5 becomes 10. 6 becomes 9, 7 becomes 11, 8 becomes 4. So it's a pretty interesting problem and it requires a bit of thinking that how would you filter out a, okay, a bike has come. So the key here is to filter the bits using the AND gate mask and creation of odd bits and even bits numbers and then using AND you separate out the even bits and odd bits and then you shift and merge them together to get the final number. So that's it. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you have enjoyed and it's a little tricky problem 
but it's not very difficult thanks keep programming to become better at uh, be become better at it thanks